hi this is a video for anyone who's feeling depressed I know a lot of people are really feeling depressed in fact more more so now than ever more and more people are saying they feel depressed they feel anxious they feel like they have nothing to live for and why is that I strongly believe it's because we've lost our connection to our mother earth that might sound pretty wacky and woo woo but we are nature, we are part of nature, but we've forgotten that. You know, we, we're shut up in offices all day, we're bombarded with Wi-Fi, we watch TV all night, we listen to the news, we listen to all this stuff that's going on in the world, and we've kind of forgotten that we too are part of this world. We don't own this world. In actual fact, the world owns us. We strive for power, as opposed to connection. We want to separate ourselves from everybody else. And that's what's leading to depression. You know, you can stand in a room with hundreds of people but feel really lost and really alone inside. And I just want to share my tips and my journey with depression. Um, most of my life I've suffered from depression um, in all sorts of different forms. Um, a lot of that is self-loathing. Um, then I've had like, issues with eating, unhappiness in my life, my relationships. Uh, depression always seems to get a grip on me if I don't do these things. So for me, a big uh, release for depression is a dead giveaway. Look around. As I said, we are part of nature, but we've forgotten that. We've forgotten our connection to our earth. We're kind of looking for all the answers and going to see doctors to get medications, but we've forgotten the answers right there. I strongly believe and I strongly feel this is what's worked for me. If I don't spend three, four days a week in nature, I really start to get the blues really, really badly. So what I do is I come out into nature and I just listen. I mean, just listen around you, listen to the sounds around you. This is a recording so you may not hear it that well, but you can hear the birds singing. You can visually, you know, you've got the, the bright greens coming through, you've got the blossom, you've got these lovely flowers, you've got insects flying around. There's just this hum in nature that, I believe it resets us, it resets our heart and it resets our vibration. So what I do is I come out into nature, sometimes I sit, sometimes I journal my feelings, sometimes I just take my shoes off and, or yeah, take my shoes off or just lay on the ground. Uh, sometimes I might do some Tai Chi, but sometimes I don't do anything, sometimes I just listen. But I really feel that you'll find your connection once you come out into nature and you'll find what makes you happy and it also gives you the opportunity to get out of your head and get back into your heart and another brilliant uh, form of therapy in nature if you've got a problem that's bugging you and you know something really awful has happened in your life and you don't really know which way to turn Honestly, my best recommendation that you can do is to go outside at night, lay on the ground and just look at the stars because it truly puts your life and your perspective, like say your life and problems into perspective. You think your problem's so big, you think your problem's so huge, but when you look out there, the vastness of our solar system into the kind of depths of the universe, you kind of realize that you're tiny speck of dust and not saying your your issues and your problems aren't important because they are but this helps you put perspective on who you are where you are in the universe where you are in our world and it just it definitely gives me comfort anyway um, I've spent many a night just contemplating my existence just looking up at the stars and just thinking wow you know how many times do you do that? How many times do you look up at the sky and look at the clouds and look at the stars? 
it just makes you realize that you're a part of something beautiful something amazing and it's yours to tap into whenever whenever you feel down and whenever you feel alone looking up at the stars you realize that you're never alone when you come out into nature you realize that you're never alone you've always got your heart your soul and your connection with your world with your home so yeah that's my thoughts for the day but try it come out get the sun on your face feel the earth on your bare feet i mean the earth is an amazing healing energy as well the earth actually pulls out uh, the positive ions in your body which are the bad ones so positive ions are put in your body from wi-fi um, 3G signals, uh, water, electric, electrical signals, so your body accumulates and absorbs all these energies and then when you stand on the earth, the uh, earth pulls it back into the ground and it charges you up and it makes you feel good and as I said honestly nature is my best therapy, I mean looking around me now I'm just like wow, what a wonderful world we live in and the more time you spend out in nature the more you will realize how wonderful our world is and how wonderful it is that you've been given an opportunity to be incarnated into this life but i hope that's helped um, if you have any questions or you want to leave a comment please do so thank you